Yo, what up y'all? And welcome back to another one. Uh, I know, that was probably a much, much uh, more positive intro yo than the last video. Uh, the last video was the disturbing news of Patty and this is the first hunt after, uh, after that day. So, everybody's on a high note. Everybody's ready to have fun. Uh, we still got our Mississippi and Kentucky clients in. They're a real special old Andy Holloway. Uh, bunch of fun, awesome group. Probably stayed up too late last night, but that's okay. Just having fun, let me tell you what. But, this is old Gerald the Beefcake Spot. That's the first time I've been here, and it's real pretty like. First time we've hunted it. Yeah, it's gorgeous. Well, there's Mallard. Oh yeah, sit up just in time for the green head. But I wanna let you guys know before we get at it here, uh, the ducks call. It's all back in stock. I'll link it down below. That's what I'll be ripping on today. Today we got seven clients, me and Gary Old, and finally, the old P Diddy. What's up? Hey, what's Diddy. up? Old P Diddy, dude. Saw it. <laughs> <laughs> so, on this video, stay tuned to the end of it. We're gonna give a, uh, a drone look at our spread. We're on a water hunt today. This is a pasture pond and it's really pretty like i said so we're gonna start doing these uh these videos where at the end we're gonna put up the drone and give you a bird's eye view of what the spread actually looks like so you guys have been requesting that forever now that i have Preston here i got the help to do it so everybody drop a comment tell p diddy thank you let's get at it oh here we are yeah buddy yeah buddy i told you it's pretty uh-huh uh-huh little hike in this is the a-frame situation uh we have some visitors the cows they see this uh voluptuous grass that we have on our blinds and they're already licking their lips <sighs> yeah they're curious damn cool. very curious but huh you did what I left archer in the truck. oh no <laughs> you left archer in the truck oh Ar archie bunker dogs in the truck you can handle it until I get back. Oh, I'll be back, big daddy. Or you'll, you'll, yeah. I'll hold down the fort. Yep. Hopefully our visitors leave us alone here. But here is the situation. We waited to uh, set up. Lots of honkers on here. Let them off. Let them get off. So we didn't bump them. Hopefully it works. Yeah, buddy. Good to go. Oh yeah. I think so, man. Good yeah. to go. Good to go. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Well, there's that. That's the old duck's call like I was talking about. That's what we'll be tooting on today. They're all back in stock. Go pick one up. Link in the description below. Um, but we're set down. Hoping on an, a late morning honker flight. That's that's really the key. Oh boy. <laughs> Hello. We got a sailor, got sailor Jerry there. out left. Oh yeah, he's gonna, oh, 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 gonna have him oh. a little rest over there. Bufflehead. Bufflehead. Oh, bubble head on the, oh dog. No, no, <laughs> no, no. <laughs> bubble head, now shoot him. Should be one, two, one, two, one to the right. And that one's four actually, I believe. Is it good stuff? Good, good stuff on the old big can? The whole way in. Oh, ho, ho, ho. That's what's up. There right? you go. Ba -ba -ba Boom. What? I like it. Oh, yeah. Perfect. If you guys like Preston's footage, you know what to do. <laughs> you know what to do. Heel. 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 Come on. Heel. Heel. He's tired. Oh. Archie Daddy. <laughs> They're coming, get ready. Oh, yeah. <laughs> They're coming, get ready. <laughs> Shoot them, guys. Get them. Oh, oh, Andy. Oh, my God. Andy, that was you. <laughs> I seen it. Thank you. <laughs> Shoot them, guys. Get them. Oh, oh my god, that was you. <laughs> 
<laughs> I've seen it. <laughs> That one, the last one down, he what? He got rocked twice before he went down. Did you get it again? Beauty? Oh, you did. Let's just, let you guys can watch that. Uh, they're a coming. Oh boy, howdy. Shoot him, guys. Oh, I, uh. Something happened there. Shoot him, guys. Oh, I, uh, oh my God. something happened. I didn't, I didn't shoot. I had to eject the shell. What happened there? I didn't even let them on that first shot. They're coming at you. Yeah. I went click. That was fun. Clickety clack. Goes Bob. Whew. Tired. Had to go do some water swatting action. Pick up some some birds. Uh, I don't know. That Benelli. I don't want to say that. For some reason I'm shooting high the last two days. I don't. I have no idea why. What are you over here squalling about? We got birds coming in. Birds coming? Are they coming in or are they just coming our way? Pretty much the same path of one. Yeah, nice and low. It's going to be, gonna be oh. pretty. They're honkers too, I think. I don't see them. They're real low. Yeah, top, top oh. Right over that hill right now. That little one. I'm blind. I can't. Oh, there they are. Okay. Gotcha. Hey, <laughs> gotcha. <laughs> <laughs> What'd you say? Way to go, man! Mm -hmm. so that's awesome. <laughs> that was awesome, dude. That was incredibly awesome. Really hope uh, P did. He got that one on the big cam. Yeah, we got a bunch. Did a bunch you? of good stuff from today. Oh, I'm excited. You about ready to throw up that drone? Yeah, we getting close to being done. Yeah, I don't know. I have one more group. Except the old whole G, but that was a that? Mm -hmm. that that there that mm. wow. Well, that is it. Oh, the wind's really picking up, sorry. Uh, we're calling it. It's what, 11.30? Right at 11.30. That big group was the last ones I think we'll see. Gerald agreed, and we're gonna pick up and get on out of here. But Preston's getting ready to launch the old drone to show you what we got going on here today. It's not a big spread, but you'll get an aerial view of this beautiful little hole we're hunting here. <laughs> Well, all 
picked up. That was a muddy, muddy, muddy situation there. Me and girl would about blow our knees out trying to walk through that stuff. What you think? Loved it. Big home. You can't just be like completely positive all the time. <laughs> all the time, 100%. If I, if I had to say anything, I just like the extra hour of sleep today. I enjoy the extra half hour of sleep. For sure. Yeah, and if you guys didn't know, anniversary trip. We want you guys to come back next year. Back I will. Every Hopefully. year. Every year. Hopefully. They don't like me. <laughs> they don't like me. They'd rather hang out with those guys. Right Who? there. Where? Oh, th those guys? <laughs> what's, the, uh, what's the rundown on the, on the hunt here, G? It turned out all right. It was uh, not as expected. There'd been a whole bunch of birds on this pond for over a week, almost a week and a half. And then they've been feeding in the field just down the way for ever since I leased the place, almost a month. And then they were here yesterday. I don't know where they went, but we did do really good. Uh, we had several groups do it really, really good. We had a big, big group do it real, real good. And we made the best of it. It was a good yeah. time. Plus one spoonie. Oh yeah, we got one, one spoonie, AKA Andy <laughs> <laughs> of the ducks. Well, why, why does he call you spoonie? Well, because that's the only one that came in. If it comes in, it dies. You, I mean, that. you, it was a one shot deal there. You <laughs> yeah. clapped him. Perfect shot. Look at Preston. Why are you the first one in the truck? You ready to leave or something? Yeah. We are not going to Twin Peaks. No. <laughs> <laughs> not going. Well, we are not in Kansas anymore. I'm actually in Tulsa, Oklahoma, and we are here for my daughter's cheer competition. Yes, Harper, my daughter, she is a cheerleader and she is loving every second of it, let me tell you. We have a lot of competitions for her down here in Oklahoma, especially during uh, the winter months, you know, the fall and winter months during the season. So, long story short, what I'm getting at is uh, Gerald, Drew, Preston, uh, they're at home at the lodge guiding uh, the last day on these clients. So, the clients that we have home right now, they'll hunt tomorrow. I won't be there. That's fine. The guys handle it perfectly. Um, and then we are going on a big trip all of us together with federal at a very special place so a uh, little heads up y'all have been requesting me to do a pheasant hunt we got a special one coming uh pheasant hunt coming it's probably going to be like probably three videos from this one so be expecting that on top of that um i think what was it i, I mentioned it in another video too uh but a little update on frederick um Big things to come, really big things to come. Uh, there's some huge plans uh, for his treatment, um, surgery possibly, a big sponsor behind it and a very special place that I'm hoping that he gets accepted into for surgery and a bunch of procedures. So uh, with with Fred only being two, I really, um, <clears throat> I'm really, um, I'm really on the move. You know what I mean? I I don't want to wait <clears throat> I want to get uh, Fred fixed as good as I can as soon as possible because he's so young if he was five or six you know it might be one, an, a different type of scenario where I would just be like you know what we're just gonna keep Fred inside and 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 just let him live the rest of his life with some painkillers and whatnot but I can't do that I can't do that I, I got to uh, with him just he just turned two in October He's a he's two years and one month old pretty much, so um, I really want to get him fixed up as soon as possible. Not because I want him in the field every day, but if he gets this procedure done, and if it went really well, there's a possibility that he could hunt once a week, especially on water hunts because it's low impact on his joints. And on top of that, if it was done. He's going to live a longer, better, healthy, healthier, comfier life, being mobile and not hurting so much. So that's the plan. I'm hoping it works out. If it works out, you'll be the first to know. But big plans uh, are coming. But it's been, a, it's been an interesting week. Um, you all have been along for the ride between Patty and Fred and happy clients. We've had spectacular hunting. Um, 
I really want to know your guys' opinion. Do you guys really like these videos? Because I have one coming out that Preston completely took over. Um, you guys have been wanting to see behind the scenes on the guide process. You know, a lot of people are interested. A lot of kids, not and not just kids, younger folks, like 22, 21, 25, 18, are really interested and been asking me. You guys have a lot of questions on, Bob, I want to be... I want to be a guide well there's a video coming that uh, it's gonna be spectacular and it just shows all the effort all the teamwork and a lot of big great footage from old Preston so hope you guys enjoyed the, the drone footage you, you have been requesting to see these spreads uh, we got some massive spreads with drone footage over them so just stay tuned these videos are, are really getting hot and heavy they're exactly what I want to come here with Preston involved in big lens, big drone footage. It's, it's, it's going to be spicy, I'm telling you. But we just uh, dropped a bunch of new apparel at Ducks. The duck, the, the goose calls are in stock. I really want to thank you all for your all support throughout the years purchasing Ducks. Um, it's helped me stay afloat and helped me uh, just keep bringing you guys these videos. And I just want to say thank you for all of you being here. Um, it's been, you know, with Fred and all this stuff, just being able to vent to you guys and having your guys' uh, support and all you guys in my corner giving me your, your tips and what I should be doing with Fred has helped a ton. So, thank you guys so much. Like, thank you. It's been a stressful week. I'm sure you all can tell. It's been hard on me. So, thank you all for being here. Um, lots of videos to come. We'll be back home here soon. Pheasant hunt coming. But, until next time. Be, be Better hit that subscribe button. I've been getting laid back, baby, you should know that. I don't need your criticism, pessimism.